جان دی دی گئی اسی کی جان دی دی گئی اسی کی تھی حق تو یہ ہے کہ حق ادا ہی نہ ہو سکا جیے تو مرے کوئی فرق نہیں پڑتا مسلمان کو مگر اللہ کی زور آف اسلام لائے وہ تو ایمان ہے کامل ہے عمل شاد ہے بیکاز امام جلال الدین سیوتی سیز اٹ از حدیث پاک دیٹ یو شوڈ ایور آسک فور ڈیتھ یو شوڈ آسک فار لائف وائی If you are a gunagar and you live more, you get the tawfiq for hidayat, you'll be able to change your life. And if you are a saleh person, you'll get time to make more ibadat for Allah. Allah sabi ko umre taweel ata farmai, umre khadil ata farmai. Khas wal khusus hamani mashayikh, huzur Sayyidi Mahdi Sayyid Kabir, Daman Zalil Nuhul Ali, aur huzur Qaid Al-Millat, aur jitne mashayikh ayla shumat ya Allah sabi ko umre taweel ata farmai. I'm going to speak to you, 740 is azan. So I will speak till probably 7.39. And if I get tired before that, I will stop. Nurudhe Paak Pali Ji, Allahumma Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, Sayyidina Allah Nabiya Na. Mawlana Muhammad wa Alaihi Sayyidina Mawlana Muhammad wa Ashabihi wa Barik Sayyidina Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Woh sarware kishware risalat. Woh sarware kishware risalat. Jo arsh par jal bagar huye thay. Naye nirale tarab ke sama. عرب کے مہمان کے لیے تھے خوشی کے بادل امنڈ کے آئے خوشی کے بادل امنڈ کے آئے دلوں کے تاؤس رنگ لائے خوشی کے بادل امنڈ کے آئے دلوں کے تاؤس رنگ لے آئے وہ نغمائے نات کا سما تھا وہ نغمائے نات کا سما تھا حرم کو خود وجد آ رہا ہے حرم کو خود وجد آ رہا ہے Two shares of Allah Hadrat, I told you. Now I'm going to read two shares of Huzur Hujjatul Islam. But these shares will only be able to understand. And today is not the time to understand. Those who understand, understand. Where is the Abd? 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 اے عبد کہا معبود کہا معراج کی شب ہے راز نہاں دو نور ہجاب نور میں تھے دو نور ہجاب نور میں تھے خود رب نے کہا سبحان اللہ اب آپ بھی کہے سبحان اللہ رب نے کہا نا سبحان اللہ دی اسرا سبحان اللہ دی اسرا دو نور ہجاب نور میں تھے خود رب نے کہا سبحان اللہ طالب کا پتہ مطلوب کو ہے طالب کا پتہ مطلوب کو ہے مطلوب ہی طالب سے واقف طالب کی پت کا پتہ مطلوب کو ہے مطلوب ہے طالب سے واقف پردے میں بلا کر مل بھی لیے پردے میں بلا کر مل بھی لیے پردہ بھی رہا سبحان اللہ پردے میں بلا کر مل بھی لیے پردہ بھی رہا سبحان اللہ اللہم صلی و سلیم علی محمد و رب صلی علیہ وسلم مراج is a very vast topic a very very vast topic can you cannot cover it in time because Maharaj is when time stopped Maharaj is when time stopped when he was not there was nothing when he was not there was nothing وہ جو نہ ہو تو کچھ نہ ہو and if he is not there is nothing جان ہے وہ جہان کی the soul he is of the universe the soul he is of the universe جان ہے وہ جہان ہے if the soul is in existence then the universe is in existence and on this night when the Nabi went we all know what happened well we meaning we سنی صحیح العقیدہ باقی کو کچھ سمجھ میں نہیں آئے گا the others won't understand 
Why? They going to use the aqal. Arash pe ja ke murga aqal thak ke gira ghash a gaya. Arash pe ja ke your intelligence and intellectual capacity will follow the, the waqya of miraj and when it reaches the arsh, it will get dizzy and collapse. Arash pe ja ke murga aqal thak ke gira ghash a gaya. Allah Adib is saying to the intelligence. Up to him, manzile pari. Subhanallah, subhanallah. Now there are many, many stations to come. Ye to pehle hi asatan hai. This is only the first level. But yeah, intellect collapsed. But I'm not going to go into those discussions today. They're very deep. Today I'm only going to discuss one topic. Bashar and Abzalul Bashar. Miraj, according to Ustazullah Sahatiza, Ghazali Dawran, Mumtazul Fuqaha, Amirul Mu'mineen Fil Hadith, Huzur Sayyidi Wa Sanadi Sarkare Muhaddisay Kabir, Hafizahullah. He says, that Miraj is a miracle in which there are numerous miracles. Miraj is a miracle in which there are numerous miracles, but it is the miracle of miracles. It is the miracle of miracles. So, how many miracles are in that we don't even know? So, today I'm only going to discuss one thing and I'm going to try and do it. Very fast. I don't know how, but I'm going to try. One of the very blessed barakat of Miraj is that if you look at Miraj carefully, you and I will realize that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala by His divine grace on the eve of Miraj showed the difference, the farq, and made the fasla, okay, who is Bashar and who is Abzalul Bashar. This differentiation happened 1400 years ago. And it didn't happen here, it happened there. The difference and the distinction between who is Bashar, you know Bashar? I am going to say the translation of these two words because I am going to say it a lot just now. Bashar, man. Abdalul Bashar, the most superior of every man, of amongst all men. Bashar, man. Abdalul Bashar, the most superior of all men. Of the greatest of all, not only men, of the entire creation. Abdalul Makhlukat. But here because we talk about Bashar and Abdalul Bashar. So, one of the distinctions that we made on this night was that of Bashar and Abdul Bashar. And the eve of Miraj, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala gave the divine decree by taking Rasul Ipaq for Miraj. By taking Rasul Ipaq for Miraj, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala gave the divine decree and made it clear. And how clear? As bright as day. If the bat cannot see in day, it is not the kasoor of the sun, it is the kasoor of the bat's eyes. It's not the weakness of the sun that the bat can't see in the day. It's its eyes that it cannot see in the day. So Allah has made it as bright as day and as clear as day on the eve of Miraj that there is none like Muhammad Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam and there will be none like Muhammad Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam yahi bolne sidra wale chamane jahan ke thale sabhi mene chhan dale tere paaye ka na paaya tujhe yak ne yak banaya tujhe yak ne yak banaya mustafae zat yakta aapne Huzur Taj Shariah says Ya Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam mustafae zat yakta aap hai yak ne jisko yak banaya aap hai aur aap gil mein noor ki pehli kiran aap gil mein noor aap water gil sand aap gil mein noor ki pehli kiran in sand and dust the first ray of light 
आप गिल ने नूर की पहली किरण जान आदम जान हवा या रसोल आदम इन रसोला हवा यू सो अल्लाह सुबहान तलमीन क्लियर ऑन द ईव ऑफ महाराज बाई टेकिंग रसोल पाक फॉर दिस ब्लेस जर्नी दैट there is none like rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam and there will be none like rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam and in doing this allah subhanahu wa taala showed the difference between bashar and afdalul bashar and no creation allah taala showed that no creation can compare to him no creation can compare to him in any way see it's simple we are all what what are we bashar we are all bashar and he is afdalul bashar Very simple. We are all Bashar, and he is Abdul Bashar. We are human. He is the greatest of human, and this is proven on the night of Miraj. Okay, while the entire universe, while everybody was asleep and all the humans were asleep, I am now explaining the dist- the distinction that was shown on that night. When all the humans first point, we can make many. I am making few. First point: While all the Bashar were asleep, Abdul Bashar was receiving a special invitation. Subhanallah. While all the other Bashar were asleep, no other Bashar got this. No other Bashar got this. No other Bashar will get this. Every Bashar was asleep, and Abdul Bashar was receiving a special invitation from where? From where? Who is Abdul Bashar? Rahmatul lil alamin. Who is Abdul Bashar? Rahmatul lil alamin. And who was sending the invitation? Rabbul alamin. Rabbul alamin was sending the special invitation to Rahmatul lil alamin while the rest of Bashar was sleeping to show you you are Bashar he is Abdul Bashar. You are Bashar he is Abdul Bashar. When you want to get the attention of anybody what do you do? Ab dua kare 10 minute mein baat puri ho. When you want to get the ab mood bhi ban gaya hai. When you want to get the attention of anybody, what do you do? Shak Shak is sleeping. What do you do? Fajar, you came. You see, thora he doesn't get late. Alam, I heard from him. I'm almost everybody. But then what you do? You start going and banging on his door. That's how you wake him up, ne? You call out his name, Shak, Shak. You yell outside the door. And if you manage to get in, and Shah still can't wake up, shake him up. Shah, hold his jaw, namaz, azan. You have to give azan. Yet it's not that case. It's opposite. Shah is waking all of us. <laughs> Allah bless him with long life. During this lockdown, pandemic, and whatever, these are the people who have been the the the, 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 the guardians of the masjid. Understand? <laughs> and we must value that. We must value that. You must honor that. Because their necks will be the highest on Medan and Bashar. Understand? They are not our knocker. We should be their knocker. Something we should think about. So, if you want to wake Shah or anybody else up, you first start thumping on the door because you want to get their attention, screaming outside, yelling outside. Why? This is how you wake Bashar. This is how you wake. Bashar, you bang on the door, you yell, you shout, you shake him up. You want to wake up, Maulana Ahmed Sabir? You got to go wake him up. I know how I have to wake up Abul Barkat for Fajr in the morning. You wake up your children. What do you have to do? Shake your children up, wake them up, yell. Why? This is how you wake up, Bashar. But when Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala wants Jibril to go with an army of Malaika and get the attention of His Nabi, He says, "You don't shake my Nabi. You don't wake my Nabi. My Nabi ki kadam kuchhu. Kiss the sacred feet of my Nabi. You wake Bashar by shaking him. You wake Abdul Bashar. You don't wake. You gain his blessed nazar karam. You gain his blessed nazar karam. How? By kissing his sacred feet. That is Bashar. We are Bashar. That is Abdul Bashar." And you know we Bashar, we are proud people, proud for nothing, proud for nothing. Mar gaye to gaye kaam se. Can't pick your own hand up. Four have to pick you. Still we proud. La tam shifil awdi maraha. Don't walk in this earth with pride. As Imam Ghazali says that the person in Bani Israel walked with pride, Allah sank him into the earth till Qiyamah he'll be sinking. 
لا تمشي في الارض مراحا ها وي هيومنز بات وي جوت ذس اتس اور فطره اور نيتشر وي براود يو نو اند اسبيشلي وات وي سي اي فلو فروم هير تو دبي اي فلو بزنس اي فلو فرست كلاس سو وي ار سو براود اوف لاين تشيك اتشي بات هابي تو فلاي وي ار سو براود اوف لاين what you flew on aeroplane what you did when you flew molana it goes too fast you have to put seat belt at take off on the halat khat we have to put seat belt before landing bashar flies on man made plane have to put seat belt combat car cabin has to be pressurized cabin door has to be shut make sure that you are sitting in the right position bashar abdalul bashar 1400 years before sits on the burak and flies abdalul bashar 1400 years before is on the burak flying at the time when man didn't even dream what was flying when man didn't even dream what was flying abdalul bashar flew how who said subhan allazi yasra bi abdihi laylan min al masjid al haram ila al masjid al aqsa he flew from masjid al haram to masjid al aqsa and beyond bashar feels he is superior fast now i'm going to go very quickly bashar feels he is superior now you know why fahim bhai will tell us more those in the computer and it we are well bashar is superior now why because he has google earth because he has google earth because he has launched satellites into space would which he can see thousands of miles away satellite is stationary or moving in its orbit wherever it's been placed from there it's zooming onto your house from there it's zooming onto your car it's zooming onto you walking on the street it wants to target the building in the wall if using the the the, 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 the satellite man is superior because he invented the satellite from that height it can zoom onto your house it can zoom onto your car it can find your location look man bashar 1400 years after you learning how to zoom allah 1400 years before my nabi sat on the burak at a height where you will never reach and at the speed where you will never reach at that speed which is not faster than light speed which is faster than the word speed subhanallah speed which is faster than speed my nabi is on the burak at a height that no man will reach and he still can see musa al islam reading namaz in his cover subhanallah subhanallah this is bashar that is abdalul bashar this is man that is the most superior of men this is bashar that is abdalul bashar everything can be pinpointed but Nabi is in Medina he can't see you he can't hear you he doesn't know what's happening behind the wall maadillahi rabbil alamin kuffar ka banaya hua jisko istinja ka dhang nahi aata tere ghar dekhta hai aur nabi na dekh paaye they see and the nabi can't see what they never dreamt of the nabi can see what they never dreamt out the nabi can see or nabi to nabi hose pak says i see the entire dunya on my palm like a mustard seed like a sesame seed subhanallah nazartu ila biladillah jam'an nazartu ila biladillah jam'an ka khardalatin ala hukm at-tisal subhanallah subhanallah bashar and abzalul bashar and you know when bashar gets in to catch with abzalul bashar when bashar gets specially connected to abdalul bashar then bashar becomes wasi azam subhanallah then bashar becomes khaja gharibun nawaz subhanallah then bashar becomes ala hadrat imam ahmad raza this is bashar and abdalul bashar shown on the night of miraj i'm only talking about this and i'm not done yet see bashar bashar is served by bashar go on to the best cruise go on to the best flight go to the best resort Bashar is served on the best journey. Bashar is served by Bashar. Abdalul Bashar is not served by an angel, he's served by the archangel. Subhanallah. Not saved by, served by an angel. 
is served by the archangel Sayyidina Jibril Amin alayhi salatu wasalam. Bashar travels through. See, even Bashar wants to go to space. When the astronauts go on, they need suit. All that libas, I'm not enough time to give details. They need to be given the right oxygen. Before they sit in the space shuttle and they go up, jate nahi jate, Allah jate. Jahan tak jate. But they have to do all that. Why? Because if they pass the Qur'an Zamhariya, Zamhariya and the Qur'an Ar, if they pass the intensely cold region, without anything, they will freeze. And if they pass the intensely hot region, they will combust. They will burn. Insan can't go through. Insan can't go through like that. So with all of that they go. If they want to go into the atmosphere, into the skies, even with their shuttles, what they have to do? They have to talk themselves up properly. Why? Otherwise they will freeze. Otherwise they will burn. That is Bashar. That is Bashar. But Abdalul Bashar went beyond that. No suit. Sitting with his libas. With his humble libas. What? On the Burak. Burak had any shield? Burak had any covering? No. Bashar needs this. Abdalul Bashar doesn't need this. I'm going faster and I'm ending shortly. If Bashar travels at an immense speed, without pressurization, the body will disintegrate. If you travel without any of the equipment and all those things needed, the body will disintegrate. Bashar is, you'll be finished. Abdalul Bashar is comfortably sitting on the back of the Burak. Abdalul Bashar is comfortably sitting on the back of the Burak. No seat belt. No seat belt. No seat belt. No pressure control. No oxygen. No tie yourself up tight before the Burak lands. Burak speed. One step it takes. The next step is where your eye falls. Or where its eye falls. Where its eye falls. One step of the Burak. So what's the speed? What's the speed? You can't think. Akal won't go there. So Burak is doing all of that. Bashar can't manage without seatbelt even in the plane sometime. And up, when there's turbulence, kya hota hai? And Abdul Bashar is sitting on Burak, Burk, light, current, and he's going to the heights of the heavens. Nothing to control, nothing to hold him down. How is that possible? Simple. Bashar needs to be controlled. Abdalul Bashar controls. Bashar needs to be controlled. Abdalul Bashar controls. Burak wasn't taking the Nabi. The Nabi was taking Burak. Understand? Another thing that was shown on that night. Bashar is on earth and I'm ending with these words. This and uh, two or three words after that. Shaykh, five minutes. We'll finish before eight. Bashar is on earth. While Abdalul Bashar goes beyond the Arsh. Bashar varye kishvare risat. جو عرش پر جل بگر ہوئے تھے نئے نرالے ترب کے سامان عرب کے مہمان کے لیے تھے وہ ایسٹ آٹڈ آف بشار is on earth while after بشار goes beyond the arsh and with the eyes of his head he sees the divine vision of his رب اللہ سبحانہ وتعالی بشار is he who has to go to the most humble position بشار is he who has to go into the most humble position سجدہ to attain his معراج to attain his closeness to Allah, Abdul al Bashar is he who takes his sacred feet beyond the arsh of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. You have to put your head on the zameen, the Nabi's feet is on the arsh of Allah. This is Bashar, that is Abdul al Bashar. Bashar performs salah. Bashar performs the last point. Bashar performs salah to worship Almighty Allah. Abdul al Bashar brings salah. Abdalul Bashar, I want you to think, think about this, and this is where I'm going to, to close this discussion. Bashar performs salah to worship Almighty Allah. Abdalul Bashar brings salah as a means of worship to Almighty Allah, as the mirage of the believers, as the mirage of the believers, being blessed with this mirage. So I now ask a question. I now ask a question. Very simple question. How can the gift be a wasila? 
when we speak these bad mazhabs, what they say? Quran what says? And seek our sila towards your creator. Baktahuru ilayhi wasila. Seek means towards the creator. They say, no, wasila is, you can't say awliya and rasul sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Namaz. That's the wasila. So yes, namaz is wasila. But the question, namaz is a gift. Namaz is the gift. So how is it that the gift can be the wasila? And the wasila through who we got the gift is not the wasila. Who be wakuf can't understand this? How can the gift be the wasila? And the one who gave you the gift not be the wasila? The gift is the wasila. The acceptance of the gift is the wasila who brought that wasila. So much right. So what was taught? This is Bashar. That he has to wait for the salah to come to him. And this is Abdul Bashar who goes and brings that salah to him. Okay? So the night of Miraj is honored. Others honored because of the salah. We honor it because of the one who brought the salah. And with it we will honor the salah. Now I'm ending to ask some questions and I'm going to finish in two minutes. I wrote, I, mean, I point, noted some questions. I'm going to ask these questions. How is it that Abdul Bashar saw, saw his rub with, his, with the eyes of his head? How is it that Abdul Bashar saw his rub with the eyes of his head while no Bashar can do it? How is it that Abdul Bashar saw his rub with the eyes of the head and the ordinary Bashar cannot? First question. How did Abdul Bashar pass all the regions in the sky without a suit etc. while Bashar cannot? Or Am Bashar cannot? How did Abdul Bashar physically travel on the Burak at such speeds while, Abdul, while, while ordinary Bashar cannot? What is the secret? What is the secret? How did Abdul Bashar do all of this? Which ordinary Bashar cannot do? I thought about it today. And I found the answer in that same verse. Subhan al-lazi asra bi abdihi bi. How can he go? How can he see? How can he travel at that speed? When nobody else can. Why? Subhan al-lazi asra bi abdihi. Pure is he who took who took his most beloved servant. How can he see? His Rab took him to see. How can he travel? His Rab took him on that journey. When the Rab took him, then the Rab made the intazam for his beloved chosen servant. Not for you and I, for him. And the other answer, Hafizah is here too. Another Hafizah here too. Right? Many others I'm sure in the Masjid Shaykh will know. Another answer, and we'll end with this inshallah. How did he see? How did he go? How did he see with the eyes of his head? Allah says in the Hurat, Holy Quran, Surah Nur, Ayat number 35. Allah Nur Samawati Wal Arda. Mazal Nurihi Kamishkar Fiha Misbah. Al Misbahu Fi Zujaja. Al Zujajata Kan Naha Kaukaman. Allah Ta'ala is what Allah is saying in the Holy Quran. Nuriyan Yukadu Min Shajarati Mubarakatin. Zaytunatin La. لا شرقية ولا غربية الله أكبر Allah is the light of the skies and the earth the example of his nur is like a niche you know a hole in the wall the example of his nur is like a niche in which is a lamp and that lamp is inside a glass lantern there's a niche inside it is a chirag a candle that candle is in a that flame is in a glass lantern and the glass lantern is like a star which is ignited by a glowing pearl which is glowing like a pearl ignited by the sacred olive tree neither is it of the east nor is it of the west complicated we talk about it much later but simple Hadrat ibn Umar radiallahu anh, Abdullah ibn Umar what does he say? he says the niche is the sacred chest of Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa the niche the taq is the sacred chest of Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam and the glass lamp is the pure heart of Nabi sallallahu alayhi wa sallam and the lamp and the light, the flame is the light and the nur which Allah put in the heart of Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam so the answer is clear Bashar is powered by flesh, blood, bone and human strength 
Bashar is powered by flesh, blood, bone and human strength. And Abdul Bashar is powered by the Noor which Allah placed in his heart. Abdul Bashar is powered by the Noor which Allah placed in his heart. Through the chest manifesting into his eyes, into his hands, into his Mubarak feet. And hence Abdul Bashar saw the eyes of his head. And he traveled on that journey. And that is why Allah Hadrat. Adim ul Barkat, Imam Ahl Sunnah, Mujaddid Adi No Millat, Parwain Ahl Shamir Salat, Asha Imam Muhammad Azza, Radi Allahu An, Making Tarjaman of This Ayat of the Holy Quran. What does he say? Shama Dil Mishkat Tan Sina Zujaja Nur Ka Teri Surat Ke Liye.